Hello, I am the audience and I am recording Aitken and Ibimpe's speech during quarantine. Here we go. <clears throat> Have you ever closed your eyes and see the image of yourself falling from the sky? And right before you hit the ground, you wake up? Or have you ever closed your eyes and seen yourself in front of a crowd giving a, a presentation and knows you have no clothes on? Hoping what is happening is real? Well, for, well fortunately, you are not the only one who is seeing these, these strange images at night because people and even some animals around the globe are seeing images of themselves in a, in a strange situation. These images that we see at night while we are sleeping are called dreams. Some dreams are not even about being in a strange situation. They can be about a memory, an idea, or even trauma, a tra a traumatizing events. According to Healthline.com, one theory of the purpose of dreams is to help us store important memories and things you've learned. Dreams also <coughs> help us get rid of unimportant memories and help us understand complicated thoughts and feelings. Why do we have dreams is still a mystery to many. Dreams are complicated. We have them, but not, but no one truly understands the purpose of dreaming and why we do it in the first place. Throughout history in many different cultures, there have been theories and beliefs Many scientists and other researchers do not understand the purpose of, of dreaming. Throughout time, there have been theories and beliefs. One theory many psych uh, psychologists use on why we dream could be caused by things we are dealing with emotionally. Certain emotions we are trying to suppress that we do not want others to see may be the reason why we dream. According to healthline.com, our dreams may be a way for us to confront emotional issues that is happening in our day-to-day -day life. And because our brain is operating on a higher level when you are asleep, your brain may still operate like you're still awake. And may be a way of you confronting them. Another, another theory is our dreams are used as a flight or fight training one theory psychologists have used for the flight or flight theory is the area of your brain that is most active while you are dreaming. The, uh, it's called the obligata. The obligata is more active in our sleep than when we are awake. This is our brain preparing us for a potential threat while we are sleeping. This could be the reason why we have dreams. These are just few of many theories scientists have had. Another theory why we dream is that it helps us generate ideas. This may be helpful in problem solving, communication, and creativity. Another purpose of why we dream is for memory. Many musicians have credited their dreams for inspiration when it comes to creating their biggest hits. Dreams help us store important, important memories and things we have learned. Why we dream is a mystery. Since the beginning of the time, humans and some animals have always had dreams. Many scientists, many scientists have had many theories and beliefs on why we have dreams. Many still don't understand why. In conclusion, even though we don't know why we have a dream, dreaming is still very important to us. Dreams help us with ideas and deal with emotions and memory. Thank you.